Hey guys. So I wanted to do a video. Um, I just recently went shopping, sort of beauty bargain hunting. And I want to do um, a video on that and show you all the good deals that I found. Um, so yeah, here we go. So first I'll start off with Myers. Um, I was just there getting like groceries. Um, but sometimes I always go into like the um, clearance section, kind of close to where like um, the beauty aisles and makeup and all that's at. So this right here I got, and the tag is ripped, but I got it for $2.65. And this is Artesian Color, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, um, Baked Eye Color. And I really, really love this. I'm going to open it up and show you what it looks like. But here it is. It's just like this little pocket. Whoops. Ooh. This. And you open it up. And it's really cool. It's got like these swirls. And the pigment's like black and silver. Silver. And it's really shiny. See, just like that cool and it's really really silvery I've tried it out and I really really like it the intense is pretty pretty nice I really love this too and it's travel size you can put it in your pocket or just throw it in your bag and go so I really like this so I think this was a good find it was 30% off so I think it was a good deal okay so item number two since that one looks like that this one looks pretty similar <laughs> this is by Brimmel London it's called Loud Mouth it is called, it's called Pucker Up, that's the name of it, and the color I'll show you is like a deep mauve color, and I have tried it, sorry, <laughs> and I have to say it's not like a gloss, it's not shiny at all, it's more like a matte, light, pigmented, like lip balm, I would have to say it's not really like a lipstick, and it's not like a lip gloss, I'd say more like a balm. But it kind of has the feel of like lipstick. That's confusing. Oh, I'm sorry, the price. The price was marked down to like, I think it was like the same as this. It was like $2.50. Something like that. So that was a pretty good deal. Saved a couple dollars, hey. Better than nothing. And this, I also got this. I know I already opened it and took it out of its packaging. Um, this is NYC New York Color. And this is a concealer stick. And it's green. i show you this green. It's a really, really green color. You can see the pigment there. Um, I have tried this. And I do like it. I have to say, you have to kind of play with it. This wasn't in the sale aisle, but it was only like, it was only like a couple dollars. I wanted to try it. Um, I do use concealer a lot, but I've never tried the green. I do like it. I think you just have to make sure you don't put too much on because it gets kind of cakey. I did it the other day <laughs> and I had like a couple like green spots under my eyes so it's not very attractive. Okay, and then the last thing I got there, like I said, I already opened it. <laughs> um, this was originally $4.99 and I got it for $3.49. So I saved a little bit. I love this. I absolutely love this. Um, I love Maybelline products and eyeliner, and I've never tried this one before. This is Line Express. Cool, I'll pull it out for you. And this is in Charcoal Gray, 906. And if you can see, one tip is the pencil, and then the other side, other end, is the rubber tip for blending. I love this little guy. I love the, love it. So that's it. That's all I got for Myers. So we'll move on to Walmart. My nail polish always peels and cracks. It drives me crazy. So I really want to try this. I have used Sally Hansen products before. So I think that this will work really well. And it's supposed to last for up to 10 days. Um, and it's the Insta Dry Anti Chip Top Coat in the red bottle and I was looking for this all over and there was only three left so I hurry up and grabbed it and I'm like oh I gotta grab it and run before they're all gone <laughs> yeah so this I think was a uh, very important purchase so I hope it will help and I'll let you know in future videos if it works or not Ugh, it does work 
Okay, so the other thing I bought, I bought some hair clips. I know that's kind of random. Try to find something better. And I got these squinchy, I don't know how you say it. Squinchy? It's called squinchy. Um, these little um, no slip grip all day hold. And so far it hasn't ripped out my hair. Um, and hopefully it doesn't. Because I've been really not liking pulling out my hair clip every time I pull out, I'd pull out hair. Ah. So these have been really great so far. Um, if you want to try them, you can find them anywhere pretty much, I'm sure. CVS, Walgreens, Walmart, Kmart, blah, whatever. Wherever you shop at. Oh, these are only three dollars, by the way. I forget that. Prices, prices, prices. Okay. Okay, so my cousin Rachel had told me about the Falsies Lash by Mangaline. And so I thought, okay, what the heck, I'm just going to go ahead and and buy some. Because I usually try to buy mascara every, you know, a new bottle every four months. And they usually just tell you three months or whatever because of the bacteria. And so I got, this is actually new. This is the Falsies Lash Flared. You can see it's got these really cute little angel wings on there. You can see that. And I got it in very black and waterproof. So far, I have tried this, and I do like it. I'm actually wearing it right now. You know, I do like it, but then I don't like it, so. I really like the design, though. <laughs> the design's really cute. And it wasn't really clumpy at all. I think it just didn't give my eyelashes that oomph volume that I was really, really hoping for. You know, because it is called Volume Express. Okay, and I picked up a pack of these at Walmart. Throw away, um, what are they called? Oh, these little, uh, soft, squishy applicators. They look just like this. They're all the same shape. These are really great for applying eyeshadow, or maybe even for removing something. So these are really great. You can throw them away, or you can keep, I keep using them, but yeah, I bought a whole pack of these. Really, really handy. First time I've ever bought these, actually. I really like them. Okay, and that's one of my favorite finds. You can't beat that for $1.98. Really great little makeup applicators. I also bought... Um, if you don't know, Walmart has a line of products called Hard Candy. And I've only seen them at Walmart. And, um... I bought a couple different things from that line of products and they've been okay. I probably won't be purchasing any more hard candy products because I was really disappointed. Um, but here it goes anyways. I got two lip glosses and again, I really like the packaging, it's cute. The line is called Glossaholic, <laughs> that's kind of funny. Glossaholic, really pretty packaging. And I got this in, it's called Fireball, and it's a bright red color, you probably can't see it on camera. And I was hoping it would be like a bright red lip gloss, but it's not. I'll show you really quick um, on my hand. And I have to say I'm so disappointed that I spent money on this, these two products. Um, because one, this one was $5 and this one was like $6. It's hard to pull out. And it's really sticky, really thick. It's just like, see how sticky it is? And it's disappointing because I really like the color. I like the smell of the product, and it's a shiny pink color there. So, and also you can see, I just started using it and see how it's clumping up on the inside of the wand. And you know girls what I'm talking about. Once, you know, from doing this, the um, gloss gets up inside there, and then when you try to twist the bottle, it starts oozing out of the sides. Yeah, that's not good. I don't like that at all. I'm very particular on my glosses, and I don't like it when a gloss does that. And so the second thing I bought was another lip gloss. This is a plumping. It's called Plumping Serum Volumizing Lip Gloss, and the name of this is Nude Beach. Now I have to say between the two, I think I like this one a little bit better. Um, but I do like the products, but it just kind of sucks that they're not the best quality as I was hoping. Um, 
for the price. You know, I don't think it's worth the price. I really don't. Oh, but this is a smaller wand than the other one. And this is a lot better quality, I think, um, than, the, than this one here. Um, the wand is smaller. I don't like the big chunky wand. Uh, so, yeah, and that's that. Okay, so that's it. Those were my top finds. Um, bargain store hunting for makeup. Um, I hope, you know, if you have any questions on any of these products, um, just leave me a comment on my page or maybe down at the bottom after this video. If you haven't subscribed, please do. I really should appreciate um, all your support. And I'll try to do my best to support you back. Um, the holidays are coming up and I really, really, really want to try to do um, maybe some nail tutorials and I'm coming up with some different nail designs and maybe do a how-to video. I hope you do a thumbs up for this video and I hope you like it. Show me lots of love. Thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you next time. Bye!